Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. In my pursuit to getting better, richer and smarter, I share everything I learn in this video here and on my blog. So if you like the content that I'm sharing in this video, please consider liking it. But don't do it now, do it after watching this video fully. In this video, I'll be talking about the best video editing apps for mobile phones in 2022. With the ever-growing popularity of video content, it is no surprise that more and more people are looking for ways to edit videos on their phones. And while there are a number of great video editing apps out there, it can be tough to know which ones are the best. And that's why in this video, I'll be giving you my top 5 picks for the best video editing apps for mobile phones in 2022 and beyond. So if you're interested in finding out which apps will make your video editing life easier, make sure you watch this video until the end. Number 1 on my list is Adobe Premiere Rush. This app is great for quickly editing and sharing videos on your phone. It has a simple yet powerful interface that lets you quickly trim, merge and add effects to your videos. And the USP of Adobe Premiere Rush is its simplicity, speed, and cross-platform compatibility. That means it will work on Android, iPhone, web, and every other platform that you know. Premiere Rush is a simplified version of Adobe Premiere Pro and is designed to be used on mobile devices and computers. It is faster and easier to use than Premiere Pro and can do editing on the go. Premiere Rush is also compatible with a range of devices including Android, iOS, Windows and Mac and the app includes all of the basic features you need to get started such as timeline, video and audio tracks and the basic effects. However, what sets Premiere Rush apart from other video editing apps is its unique set of features that makes it ideal for creating videos on the go. First, Premiere Rush includes an automatic backup feature that ensures your work is always saved and available even if you lose power or connectivity. Second, the app's seamless integration with Adobe Creative Cloud means that you can access your Rush projects from any device anywhere. And finally, Premiere Rush's easy export options make it simple to share your videos with the world. Let's look at its problems also. Though. The biggest problem with Adobe Premiere Rush is that it's very unstable and often crashes. It can be very slow and sluggish, especially when trying to edit larger projects. The software lacks many features that are available in other editing programs, which can make it difficult to create complex projects. The interface also can be confusing and difficult to navigate sometimes making it challenging for new users to get started. For small projects however, I would highly recommend Adobe Premiere Rush. Second on the list is Apple Clips. This app is perfect for quickly creating and sharing fun videos with friends and family. It has a variety of built-in filters and effects that lets you easily add a personal touch to your videos. Some of the key features that makes Apple Clips unique are its live titles, animated stickers, and ability to record hands-free. These features allow users to easily create fun and creative videos without the need for complex editing tools. For example, you can use the app to create stop-motion videos, which is a cool effect that can make your videos stand out. Additionally, the app has a number of filters and effects that you can use to enhance your videos. And you can also add text and stickers to them. Overall, Apple Clips is a great video editing app that has a lot of great features for its users. But now, let's also look at the problems with Apple Clips. The app is not very user-friendly compared to some other apps that can be difficult to navigate. There are also not a lot of editing features, so it can be difficult to create professional-looking videos. Let's move to the third app on the list. It's called Splice. The app is ideal for creating professional looking videos on your phone. It offers a wide range of features, including the ability to add music, transitions, and text to your videos. One of the most unique and powerful features of Splice is its ability to automatically create videos from photos and video clips. I love this feature. This is done by using algorithms to identify faces, objects and locations in the photos and videos and then creating a story around them. This can be a great way to quickly and easily create videos that would otherwise be very time consuming to make. Splice is also a very user friendly app with a simple interface and that makes it easy to get started with. There are also a number of built in tools and effects that can be used to enhance enhance your videos. There are a few potential problems also with Splice that users should be aware of. First, the app has been known to crash or freeze occasionally. Second, some users have also reported issues with the audio quality of Splice videos. Finally, Splice's video editing features are relatively basic. So more advanced users may find it lacking. Fourth on our list is Quick. This is a great app for quickly editing and sharing videos on your phone. It has a simple interface that lets you quickly trim, merge and add effects to your videos. And the USPs of Quick are its speed, 
convenience and ability to be used without an internet connection. Another great thing about Quick is that you can also save your videos in a variety of formats, including HD. Finally, Quick is a very affordable video editing app. It is only $4.99 US dollars on the App Store. And this is a great price for an app that has so many features. Let's get to the problems though. There are several problems with Quick. First, it's not very user friendly and has a steep learning curve for beginners. Second, it is not very reliable and often crashes or produces errors. Third, it is not very flexible and does not allow for much customization. And finally, $499 might be a steep price to pay when there are many free options available. Last one on our list is called WeVideo. This app is perfect for creating and sharing videos on your phone. It offers a wide range of features in including the ability to add music, transitions and text to your videos. The USPs of VVideo are its user friendliness, affordability and flexibility. The software is easy to use even for beginners and it offers a wide range of features that allow users to create professional looking videos without spending a lot of money. Also, VVideo is highly flexible allowing users to create videos in a variety of formats including HD and 4K. VVideo is cloud-based video editing app that offers users a variety of unique features like I mentioned above. And one of the most notable features of VVideo is its ease of use. The app is designed to be user-friendly and even those with no prior video editing experience or beginners can create professional looking videos with VVideo. Another great feature of this app is its flexibility. The app allows users to edit videos from their smartphones, tablets, or even laptops. This means that users can edit videos on the go without having to carry around a bulky video camera or laptop. VVideo also offers a wide range of video editing tools. These include basic features such as trimming and adding transitions as well as more advanced features such as green screen and even slow motion. This means that users can create videos that look and feel professional regardless of their skill level. Finally, VVideo offers a variety of pricing options to suit different budgets. This app has a free version that includes basic features as well as a monthly subscription option that gives users access to all of the app's features. VVideo offers a great option for both casual and serious video editors. There are a few problems with VVideo though. First, the quality of the videos is not always great. The videos can be pixelated sometimes and the audio is sometimes glitchy. Second, it can be difficult to find the right video of your project. The search function is not always accurate and the videos are always not well labeled. Finally, VVideo can be slow and unreliable. Sometimes the app takes a long time to load and videos can take forever to render. There are a few things you have to consider when choosing the right video editing app for mobile. The first thing is what kind of features do you need? Do you need something basic or do you need something more advanced? The second is what kind of device are you using? Some apps are only compatible with certain devices like Android or iOS. And the third you need to know is your budget. Some apps are free while others cost more. Money. The fourth point is how easy is the app to use? You don't want something that's too complicated like a professional video editing program. And the fifth is of course customer support. You want to make sure that the app has good customer support in case you have any problems. These are just a few things to keep in mind when choosing the right video editing app for mobile. Check out the apps mentioned here. The links to each of them are given in the description. By the time I'm publishing this video, I'll also check if any of them have any discount coupons available so that I can post them too. So do check the links down in the description. All the best and see you in another video. This is Mani Karthik signing off.